Here, let me tell you a story. Ancient Chinese mystery. It's called Mystery. Or actually, it's not a mystery, but it's more of the story or tale of the ancient Chinese laundryman. For this, you need to use your imagination. You need to imagine that this piece of rope is a, or this piece of clothesline is a piece of clothesline. And that this piece of laundry is a, um, well, piece of laundry. Okay, you with me so far? All right, thought so. All right. So we're going to take this piece of laundry. Now here's what the laundryman did to hang his laundry. He'd take a piece of rope and first, or the clothesline, and he would tie the clothesline to the laundry with a double knot, like so. Now you would think that's pretty secure, just like so. But see, you don't know what's happened, so he's going. To, you don't know what's going to happen, so he ties the laundry to the clothesline. This is before the invention of clothes pins, by the way. So now you have the clothesline tied to the laundry and laundry tied to the clothesline. And he would take the laundry and the or line and he would tie it to two trees like so. Now, so you have the laundry here and the rope here between two trees. Now I'll move it back so you can see it. Now, what happens? during monsoon season. It could rain. It could rain. What do they do if it rains? I know, I was thinking the same thing. Well, what he did, that's why a laundryman always carry an invisible hole in their pocket. Right there. Yeah, I know, that's probably why they keep their uh, pants tucked into their uh, boots. So here's what he would do. He would take out the invisible hole, like this, and run out there when it starts to rain, put it onto the rope, about right there, slide the laundry up to the hole and off. And then he would take all the things off, like so. And that is the mystery of the ancient Chinese laundryman.